Students and teachers alike are getting ready to head back to class at Bago Community Schools, better known as the Jimtown Jimmies. This Elkhart County School has about 1,800 kids, and they're led by Superintendent Byron Sanders. I spoke with Mr. Sanders about the dedicated students and teachers at Jimtown. Nearly one in three of our high school uh, seniors in, in this year's graduating class graduated with 15 or more college credits. And so that, that equates to almost a semester of college uh, completed before they even leave high school. We had something like 1,300 dual credits earned at Jimtown High School. And uh, that tr translated into well over $300,000 worth of college savings for our students. And so we're proud of that. We're happy to partner with Ivy Tech and we just look forward to those opportunities as we continue mo moving forward. Now you have a preschool at your at your facilities, and I think that has been a really, really big bonus for these teachers. The preschool is now in its second year. It's in our second year. Uh, we uh, were given the opportunity by our school board to uh, take that on. We wanted to provide uh, an opportunity for teachers uh, who were on campus to have uh, on campus uh, childcare. Uh, and we needed to work hard to make sure that that uh, was uh, not a cost to the district and we've been successful. And so the board's going to let us continue that. I think the board would like to see us expand that to offer uh, daycare or, and preschool opportunities to the community. And we need to expand the program in order for that to happen. But right now we're able to continue to provide child care, child care and preschool services for our teachers. Now, the Jimmies have posted improved I Learn scores in the district, especially in the upper elementary classes. If you want to hear more from my interview with Mr. Sanders, just go to our website and click on this story.